Oh no, let's not die here. Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Ow! That was almost really bad. Alright, well I've been washed out to sea. Man, those are some strong currents to only be like ankle deep. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Luke here, and today we are back in Skyrim once again. Where we left off, we were hanging around outside this here uh, portal that we uh, opened up here. Um, we, last episode, inadvertently stumbled upon the Falskar mod, and I've decided I guess we'll go ahead and just try it. Um, worst comes to worst, I guess I could figure out some way to get back to the mainland. I don't think you can get back to the mainland of Skyrim until you finish it, but... Uh, the quest line, but I mean, we'll, we'll give it a try. It seems like it could be fun, maybe. Maybe it won't be too difficult. And uh, so, hopefully, uh, the game doesn't crash and everything goes well. E oh, and maybe they have Quicksilver here. And then I can make my sword. That would be awesome. Okay. We're all here. Did you just come through that portal? Yep, sure did. Well, if you just came through that, then then that would make you the traveler, wouldn't it? I travel from here to there and, you know, other things. You know. They who arrive to the shimmering gate mark the start of the worst. It's a just a story, of course. I'm going to assume you're from Skyrim. You somehow managed to get the portal working. My yep. job would dictate that I arrest you right here and now. Why? What did I do? I'm I just put a box thing in the thing and activated a portal. If you give me a hand with it, afterwards you're free to go. I'm searching for a Nord named Machias. He's the blacksmithing apprentice in the nearby town of Ember Creek. I assume that since he isn't in here, he's in the nearby cave. Unfortunately, I can also assume that that cave is full of bandits. Oh boy, I just fought a whole bunch of bandits to get here. Your arrival to my superiors, but if you assist me, I'll say you were cooperative and helpful. Oh, also, the switch to lower these bars is out here, and it looks like your portal thing has shut off, meaning I'm the only one who can let you out. Don't toy with me, man. I can kill you through these bars. But I won't. Sounds fair. All right. Let me lower these bars for you. So before we came here, I was thinking about maybe going to the to the, like a merchant or something, to get, uh, like to lose some of the stuff we had, uh, so that we you know wouldn't be over encumbered or anything. But I just divvied up a whole lot of the stuff I was carrying between Carjo and Lydia. Uh, and we're, we're decently underweight now. Carjo actually has like a... Uh, <laughs> I gave him like this bandana I found and I, uh, he looks kind of cool on him. <laughs> okay, where to? Um, Olvir? Olvir? Olvir, that's an odd name, friend. I'm gonna loot this place real quick. Catch up with you in a minute. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. There's nothing in here to loot. <laughs> well, nothing in there to loot. Amber hold. Roar. I'm a grizzle bear. Roar. You know, interesting thing. Has nothing to do with Skyrim, but most of my life I assumed that, uh, 
that grizzly bears were actually native to where I live. Or, well, around where I live, like, in at least in my state. I live in Tennessee, uh, for reference. Turns out, no. I just found that out a couple, like, months ago. There are no grizzly bears in Tennessee, n naturally, like, here. Has nothing to do with this game or anything. It's just an interesting thing that I just popped into my mind seeing that grizzle bear on the loading screen. All right, let's go rustle up some banditos. Ooh, coins. Where did where did Dude Bro go? Oh, there you are. Now you're not gonna hang out in the back and yeah. You're going to be a part of this fight, too. Hello, bandit. Crap. Okay, I'm going to reload before I accidentally hit that dude in the back. Why, why does everyone have to run in front of me? Does everyone want me to kill them? I keep hitting my dog. Why do I keep accidentally hitting everyone I'm not trying to hit? Please, please move. Aha! Lightning versus lightning then! My lightning's stronger. Did he just kill that dude? Oh no, dude's fine. I thought he just straight up killed the the dude. I thought he like because he looked like he just like fell flat on the ground and that dude had like some kind of crazy hammer. Yeah, what what kind of hammer is that? Wow, man. No kill like overkill, I guess. Ooh, a dwarven sword. Dwarver sword. Why would there be a switch? There's clearly a padlock on this. What is it? Are you alright? The bandits, they're working for Ingvar. Oh. I overheard them talking. Money. They're searching something. That's why they kidnapped me. What are they searching for? What could you possibly know? They wanted to know about some key, and when they found I didn't know anything, they were enraged. They were deciding what to do with me when you two showed up. Agnar must know about this. I'll have our friend here tell him. You go home and get some rest. Thank you for saving me. I'll see you in Amber Creek. Go to Amber Creek to the southeast. I'd go but have a patrol to keep. And Matthias is rattled and needs to rest. Once you're there, find the Jarl Agnar in the main house. Tell him the bandits are working for Ingvar. It's imperative that he knows. He may also have a reward for you for delivering such that? important information. If you follow me, I'll unlock the gate for you. Okay. I'll also say, so far, this seems pretty cool of a mod, and uh, also, the voice acting is phenomenal in this. Like, a lot of, like, uh, you know, unofficial DLC or, you know, modded quest lines like this, they'll have, like... You know, the voice acting will be okay or alright, or some of them won't have the best voice acting. But this one, so far, pretty good. Like, these dudes sound like professionals. So, if this guy's going to open the gate for me, what's the point of him even, like, sending me to go 
uh, report to this dude? I mean, like, wouldn't that be going far enough off of your, like, what's it called? Off of your, uh, patrol that, you know, it'd just be too much trouble? Okay. Later, bro. I should probably, uh, switch the quest up because I guess it's a different quest now or something? I don't know. Here we go. I guess we'll move on over this way. Definitely interesting so far. I'm liking it. And it seems like the enemies are kind of scaled to my level, I think. So it's not going to be, like, super difficult. It's going to be... It's going to be pretty much at my level. I just hope whenever I get to this town that they're sending me to, that they have like some merchants and a blacksmith that maybe sells Quicksilver. And also I need to get rid of some of these potions I've got like stored up and a few other things. Like I think like we're carrying, well that, that wolf pelt just made eight I think. I think we've got eight wolf pelts. Okay, I think we are here. This is quite the quaint little town, I like it. Howdy. Be a great warrior. I am sure of it. But only if I keep practicing. I'll go do that right now. Okay. Greetings. Hello. Uh, let's see. Okay, what? I guess. What led him to believe that? Such a statement cannot be taken lightly. This, this is bad news. It could very well mean the start of another war. Thank you for bringing me this information. Please, accept this token of my appreciation. I hate to ask huh. more of you. You have already saved one of my people. But I don't have much choice. Long ago, when there was war between my family and the Yunvaldirs, there was a group of monks that served as our wise men and court wizards. They have since retired to a simpler life, but their roots are still there. They may know what Ingvar is up to. Please, go to Balen Priory, to the southwest, and talk to Brother Thorlo. See if he knows anything. Okie doke. Well, that was easy. Just moving right along. <laughs> let's do some, uh, let's, uh, do some, I guess, shopping and stuff like that while we're in town. Maybe, just maybe, this blacksmith has what I'm looking for. This blacksmith is probably not working right now because it's night. Well, I guess we'll just have to wait till morning. Okay. Out of there. Good morning. You sell horses too? Wow. Uh, what are you selling? Take a look. No quicksilver. Are you at least selling the ore? Maybe. No! Hmm. This is a bummer.
Oh well. Ooh, that armor looks awesome. Oh yeah, in between like episodes like last time, I forgot. Uh, I did some like configuring with the uh, immersive armors mod. You can turn off some armors that that are appearing, and you can turn on some new armors and stuff that that weren't appearing before for some reason. And this is one of them that I think I turned on that wasn't appearing. And I turned off a few others that were appearing. This one looks crazy cool, like the helmet and everything for it look really crazy. <laughs> um, but I guess, uh, oh, well we could have sold him some potions maybe. If you need anything, just let me or Rangar know. You sell stuff too? For that I must repay. Take these. It's the least I can do. Oh, well, thanks. Some of those are pretty cool. Wow, okay, I don't need to be over encumbered. Please stop giving me stuff. Um, eh, I'll sell some stuff off camera. Alright, now we're all set. Oh yeah, and I heard that the, the mod has like its own like soundtrack and everything, and I can hear it, and it sounds pretty cool. Onward! I've also did a little bit of looking into this mod, and there's a ton of side quests. So I might get into some of those too, because that sounds kind of cool. Also, it just looks awesome and everything, man. This is pretty cool. I just really wish we could find some Quicksilver. That would make this whole experience really awesome. Cause then I have like the new sword that we've been that we've been wanting to get for like five episodes now. I see you wolves. Yes. Not really. I know that a growing problem in our world of Falska, but uh, nothing else. That couldn't be. Unless trying to start another war. Regardless, we cannot help. Seven hundred years ago, Shore saved our ancestors so that we could flourish in this land and absorb its knowledge. Not tell it apart with war. We will not help instigate another one with the Borvaldas. Of course, we are so loyal to the Borvaldas. If it comes to it, we will fight. By Kigagnar's son until victory, or Sovereign God takes us. It's a dangerous world these days. Be careful. This is seeming a little fetch questy, because we're like back and forth quite a bit. Already. <laughs> now we gotta go all the way back to uh, the town. Hmm. And here, uh, in case you're wanting to see it, is like an overview of the map, I think. Looks kind of cool. It's a crazy, crazy look to the landscape. It's like all surrounded by like mountain, pretty much. It's pretty neat. And I'm guessing these are all different like towns, maybe, or castles in the area. Huh. Cool. We will have to do some traveling, I guess, or maybe it'll, like, just missions will take us there over time. Hmm. This definitely seems like quite the mod. Where's a uh, where's dude? Hey dude. Have you spoken with Brother Doro yet? Unless he instigates war. He sent men to kidnap and interrogate one of our people. And he blankets the land with his mercenaries. 
Is that not a declaration of war? Very well. We shall work without their help. For now. I need you to do something else for me. Bandits have overrun the docks and have got off trade with Skyrim. Please, go to the docks and kill all the bandits. Then, talk to Henry. He runs the trade store there. Ask him if he learned anything helpful while the bandits were there. Good. That sounds kind well, no, we gotta go speak to someone again. I was thinking we were gonna go we were gonna go fight I was thinking we were gonna go fight bandits, but now it seems like we might not. And it's gonna be more fetch questy stuff. Hopefully not. Okay, where are we going? Whoa, -wee, that's a good ways away. Alright. I'll see you guys there unless we run into something interesting along the way. Well, we've ran into some bandits here, and they're trying to kill my dog. So, uh, we're gonna kill them. To use a potion, I almost died there. Oops, wrong potion or ability. Okay, well, that was something. Hmm. So it looks like we found a hatch that goes further into this bandit camp. Why not? We can, I guess, stray out the beaten path a little bit, take on some bandits, have a little fun. Little exploration. Sneak attack. <laughs> I found some new boots. Let's uh I guess continue on our journey toward wherever we're going right now. I will see you guys either when we get there or if we run into something else interesting along the way. What? Nah! Actually, it looks like we've ran into something interesting just a couple seconds after uh, after I said that. Look at this! Man! That looks awesome! Dude, some people worked really hard on this mod. Dude, this looks awesome. What? No! We gotta find an easy way to get around here, though. I don't wanna try climbing down the mountain there. My followers probably won't catch up for a long time if I do that. What? No! And also, I saw this castle over here, and it got me um, wanting to check it out because. Because it's ADHD. It's probably another bandit camp. We'll look at that later, maybe then. Um. Wow. Dude. The detail in this. And just like the sheer size of all of it. Okay. We're going to try to scale down this mountain here. Hopefully not die. 
Oh, you know what? I think I have a shout for this, actually. I hope it lasts long enough for me to make it down there, though. Uh. Ooh, boy! Okay, it worked. And wow, I found some gold. Nice. This water current is really strong. Ooh, a chest. Nice. Ooh, that shield looks cool. Oh no, let's not die here. Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Ow. That was almost really bad. Alright, well I've been washed out to sea. Man, those are some strong currents to only be like ankle deep. How did you guys get down here that fast? Okay, so we just found this new, another new place, and this place is just packed with a whole bunch of different like places to discover. But um, I feel like the episode has went on for quite a bit now, so I'm gonna call it here. And next episode, we'll go ahead and continue this mission and maybe get into some side quests. But that is all for this time, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, a like rating is much appreciated. You can also comment down below and let me know what you think. And also, if you really enjoyed the video, consider subscribing uh, so you can see whenever I upload new videos. And also hit the notification thing, my Bob Bell thing, uh, to be notified whenever I upload new videos. Um, but also, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, comment, let me know what you think, uh, what we should do in the future as far as Skyrim goes, like what missions or quests we should do and what games you guys would like to see me play in the future. But uh, yeah, that's all for this time guys. Take care and bye.